Hello everyone, welcome back to another Brand Quest 29 video and today we will be unboxing uh, 8 cars exactly today. It's a bit dark. Uh, you got the Ford Bronco, the, the Koenigsegg, let me see it, the Dramera, the Sally, um, a Lotus Elise, the EV GMC Boo, the Alfa Romeo AT Competition, I think. Yeah, it's a the Lucid Air. And last but not least, the Rebel Wheel. Let's see. Which one should I put to open? I think I'll pick the Lucid Air. Let me see. Okay. This is it. The Lucid Air. Uh, I hope I'm not making it hard for myself. Okay. I think I might. Yeah, I think I might be making this hard for myself. I. Oh, wait, I found an opening. I think I found an opening. I think I found it. Uh. Sure, the camera will get it. Oh my goodness! What did I just do to myself? I mean, what am I doing? Ah! Uh, what am I doing this? I. Oh boy, this is not fun. Oh my goodness. Hmm, I could try getting this opening. Oh. Oh, uh, oh boy. This is not turning out as good as I thought it would. Oh. Oh wait, I found it, I got it, I, I got it, apparently, okay, let's get that, and, oh, 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 okay, it could trash over here, there's too much trash that I can't really organize it. This is the Lucid Air. You can't really see it because it's a bit too dark, but yeah, I got away. Oh, that's much better. As you can see, there's the interior. This is made last year in Malaysia. Interesting. Oh. Okay. That's one. I think we'll go for Sally next. Yeah, let's go for Sally. Okay. I'm just gonna put the Lucy over there. Okay. I'm gonna try to not make this harder for myself. Oh. I, I, I legit just made a hole in the packaging. Let's see. What is this made? Made in Thailand. Oh, well, looks like I got a Thailand Porsche. Oh my goodness. I always make this hard for myself. Oh my goodness. Goodness me. Oh. Ah, goodness me. Oh, my goodness. Oh, finally, found an opening. Oh, my goodness. 
I am really bad at opening packages, I'm going to be honest. Okay, there's Sally. Let me just put all this trash aside. Yeah. There's Sally. And this. It's a bit of stuff on the tires, but I just need to remove that. Um, that's just that's just cardboard. Made in Thailand. There's a port. There's a little Porsche trademark. Yeah, there it is. You can see it. It looks nice. California, 301 PCE. I'm guessing PCE means Porsche. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, P PCE definitely means Porsche. Maybe, maybe this license plate means that Sally was a 301 Porsche maid. I guess. Maybe. Let's see, let's go for the Bronco next. Okay, let's see, please. Oh, oh, finally, yes, yes, yes. Okay, just gonna keep it like that. Boom, there you go. Okay, oh boy. Here's the Bronco. This actually looks pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, this looks pretty good. Let's see, where was this made? Two years ago, Malaysia. Huh. This is my first Bronco I ever had. This is actually really cool. I'm not gonna lie. That's cool. Okay, uh, let's see. Uh, hmm, let's see. We have the slanted Batmobile, the car egg, the Alpha Romeo, the Lotus, and the GMC. Let's go for the GMC. This is actually new for 2022. Huh. Wait, hold up. This was made in 2021. What a ripoff. What a ripoff. This was made in 2021. They're fooling us. Okay, just because I've never seen that Punisher last. Slanted Batmobile. Let's see, this was. Can we see it? Uh, yeah, you can't really see it. I'll just open up the packaging. All right. Uh, let's see. I don't think it says on here. Oh wait, yeah, it does. Right up here. Made in Malaysia. Okay. Oh my gosh. Finally, yes, yes, yes. Oh boy. Okay. Here is the one and only slanted Batmobile. Apparently, this is a TV series Batmobile, which I did not see that when I picked it up at Target. Uh, let's see. Yep, DC Comics trademark. Darn shutting Paul. Anyways, uh, eh, if it weren't slanted, I would I would say that this was a ten out of ten. I would bring out the bigger version, for example. So this is the bigger version. Well, obviously there is a complete difference in coloring obviously 
but I would rather have it like this, not like stands. It, it doesn't, in my opinion, it doesn't really fit with it. It would be like this. Fun fact, this has been sitting, well, it's been sitting for a very long time, so that's why it looks like really dusty. Yeah. Okay. Off of this. Rip off. Not rip off, actually. Just put that over there. Let's put the rest it over there. Okay. Uh, let's see. Go for the alf next. This. I can't. This looks way too nice. Very nice. Makes sense why it's in the factory fresh series. 7 out of 10. Ho! Oh. <coughs> what? Uh. What the? Uh huh? That was so easy! the easiest one I've ever opened. <laughs> what? What? How do physics work at this point? Like, how? This packaging is in so much good shape. It's in so much good shape that I'm gonna keep it. It might sound weird to some of you, but yeah, I'm gonna keep it. Let's see. Lotus Elise. Here we go. Oh, never mind. Lotus Sport, at least. Hey, that was funny. Uh, okay, uh. I'll just keep the cardboard. Yeah. Okay. Here it is. Oh, yeah, I forgot to show you this one too. Oh, I thought it was damaged. Yeah, these, these look nice. You can't argue with that. These look really nice. Let's see, the Lotus was made in Malaysia of last year. This one was also made in Malaysia, but it doesn't have the year. Huh, not to brag, but I got some cars that are very old, I gotta say. I think one is in 1979, so yeah. Next up, Koenigsegg Gemera. If I were to own a Koenigsegg, this would be one of the least ones I want to get. I'd say the one of one, maybe, or the Agira RS, but not this. This just looks like an SUV, but slanted, and it's a coupe, and it's basically meant for speed. But the interior looks nice, like. Look at that. that, that looks nice. Then i put the alpha over there. Okay, uh. Okay. Okay, I might keep this. Or I might just keep the cardboard, I don't know. Dang. As a hot version, this actually looks pretty really nice. I'm not gonna lie. As a matter of fact, all hot goods are actually pretty nice. And at my target, oh, this is made in Malaysia in last year. The hot wheels there are mad cheap. They're 95 cents each. Well, they are very popular, so I can understand why they're sold at 95 cents, but dang. Might as well just round it out to a dollar. 
here is the last one, aka the ripoff. Wait a minute. The Koenig's Egg Jamera was also a new one for 2022. Wait, oh, crap. Camera failure. Anyways. Did we get ripped off again? Oh my gosh. Got ripped off and I didn't even notice. And I even said it out loud. That is just sad. Oh. Okay. Oh. 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 Okay. I, I got it. Oh, GMC Homer HD. Okay, this is a robot. I might keep the cardboard. This looks nice. I think this would be good and real. Wow. They put in all that effort just to put an escape word in there. Dang. Wow. That actually looked a bit better than I expected it to be. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not really into off roaders. But my opinion is pretty cool, so. I guess. So in total, there are. I think there are. I think there are six gasoline cars and two electrics. That's surprising. I think I have a Tesla laying around here somewhere, but. I don't know where it is. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Um, by the way, the ATK4 movie, that will be out soon. So if you wanna keep posted, check out my gaming channel. And with that, see you guys next time. Goodbye.